bits of entertainment now. Practitioners in the film industry have hailed the ingenuity of young people who have found ways to use their smartphones to shoot creative masterpieces. This comes as stakeholders gathered at the Lagos International Smartphone Film Festival held in Lagos. According to organizers, the event united filmmakers, content creators, and industry insiders to push the boundaries of mobile filmmaking. Practitioners noted that technological advancement has led to the growing trend of smartphone use to shoot films. They, however, called on young people to continue to chase their passion, know their audience, and seize every opportunity that comes their way. The service of now, South Africa had to bring him back to Nigeria to do the same thing that he was not taking here. Passion, passion, thank you. And now to the Middle East, where Hezbollah has confirmed the death of his leader, Hassan Nasrallah, after his daily strikes on Beirut. Hassan Nasrallah, who had not been seen in public for years because of fears of being assassinated by Israel, was one of the best known and most influential figures in the Middle East. In the meantime, airstrikes continue in southern Beirut on Saturday, with thick smoke reportedly rising over several locations in Dahir. Elsewhere, the Israeli military says that it is attacking targets in the Beka Valley, after detecting a rocket fired from Lebanon. On Friday, Lebanese officials said people were killed and 91 injured in an airstrike, with local officials saying that nearly 800 people have been killed in Israeli strikes in Lebanon since Monday.